Princess Rajwa, the wife of the Crown Prince of Jordan, recently welcomed a baby girl into the world. This joyous event marks a significant celebration for the royal family as it's the couple's first child and the first grandchild of King Abdullah II. But what does this mean for the line of succession in Jordan, where the law states that only males can inherit the throne? Could this tradition change? And what's the name of Rajwa's baby? Why was she given this particular name? Hey, I'm Kat, and welcome back to Rumor Has It. Stay tuned as we reveal all the details about the birth of the new royal baby and answer these intriguing questions in this video. The elegant Princess Rajwa is married to Prince Hussein bin Abdullah II, the Crown Prince of Jordan. The couple welcomed their baby girl on Saturday, the 3rd of July, 2024. Being the first child of the couple, the royal family, the citizens of Jordan, and the world at large are celebrating this amazing news. The video was posted on the new mother's official Instagram page on Saturday. In the video, Crown Prince Hussein could be seen cradling his beautiful baby with the song You Are My Sunshine playing in the background. Circulated photos show the new baby meeting her aunt and grandparents for the very first time at the King Hussein Medical Center Hospital located in Amman, Jordan. The royal family of Jordan announced the pregnancy of Princess Rajwa in an official statement some months ago. The statement read, The Royal Hashemite Court is pleased to announce that their royal highnesses, Prince Hussein bin Abdullah II, Crown Prince, and Princess Rajwa al Hussein are expecting, with God's help and grace, their first child in the summer of this year. The statement continued, The Royal Hashemite Court extends its sincere congratulations to their majesties, King Abdullah II and Queen Rania al Abdullah on this occasion and wishes their royal highnesses, Crown Prince al Hassan and Princess Rajwa good health and joy as they welcome their baby. Weeks before the birth of the new royal baby, the 53-year-old Queen of Jordan, Queen Rania, shared a heartwarming post on Instagram to her millions of followers to mark her beloved son turning 30. The post showed Prince Hussein and Princess Rajwa looking elegant and royal in formal attire. The mom-to-be at the time looked ethereal in an off-white dress with a fitted silhouette that revealed her baby bump. With the inclusion of expensive accessories to the outfit, the expectant mom looked just fit to be a princess. The birth of the new royal baby came a year after the royal couple's expensive wedding, which featured popular and respected guests, including the prince and princess of Wales who are royals themselves. The June wedding, which took place at Zahran Palace in Amman, was a topic of several conversations. King Abdullah II and Queen Rania hosted an extravagant reception at the Al Husseinia Palace, which had an attendance of over 17,000 guests. A whole lot indeed. The beautiful Princess Rajwa glowed in a white dress, which had a long train embroidered with flowers and was topped with a shiny diamond tiara. The gown was made by Lebanese designer Eli Saab. King Abdullah II and Queen Rania watched with admiration as their beloved son was wed during Katab, which is an Islamic ceremony held in a gazebo and conducted by the royal Hashemite court. Back to the newborn baby. The law of Jordan states that only males can inherit the Hashemite throne, no exceptions are made. This means that Princess Rajwa's daughter would not be an heir to the throne. The royal Hashemite court recently released an official statement that revealed the newborn's name. The statement stated, The Royal Hashemite Court is pleased to announce that their Royal Highnesses, Crown Prince Al Hussein bin Abdullah II and Princess Rajwa Al Hussein were blessed on August 3, 2024 with a baby girl they named Aman. The statement continued, The Royal Hashemite Court extends its sincere congratulations and best wishes to their Royal Highnesses and to their Majesties King Abdullah II and Queen Rania Al Abdullah on this happy occasion. Their royal highnesses are immensely overjoyed and thankful for welcoming their firstborn and call on well-wishers to consider donating to the Alamun Fund for the future of orphans in lieu of sending gifts or flowers. The name Amman is an Arabic name that means faith or belief, which adds up as the video release showed Prince Hussein cradling his child and reciting the call to prayer in her ear, a tradition that signifies the value of faith in the life of the child. The name Iman is also a touching tribute to the royal family because Prince Hussein's sister's name is Princess Iman bint Abdullah. Also, King Abdullah's half-sister shares the name as well. Prince Hussein and his sister, Princess Iman, share a very strong bond as he escorted her down the aisle when she got married in March 2023. Princess Rajwa was born to a well-known and wealthy Saudi Arabian family in Riyadh. 
Prince Hussein was named the Crown Prince of Jordan in 2004, at the age of just 15. This was after his father, King Abdullah II, stripped his half-brother, Prince Hamza, of the title. 62-year-old Abdullah II has ruled over Jordan as a trusted ally through more than 20 years of commotion in the Palestinian territories, Israel, Iraq, and Syria. Have you ever wondered how Prince Hussein met his belle Rajwa? Well, according to Vogue Arabia, the crown prince met his wife in a way that we all might be familiar with, through a friend. At a forum held by the Crown Prince Foundation in April 2023, the crown prince said, I met Rajwa through an old friend from school. I consider myself lucky because it's not every day you meet someone like Rajwa. How heartwarming is that? However, we're unsure of which school exactly the prince was referring to, although they both went to university in the United States. The radiant Princess Rajwa earned a degree in architecture from Syracuse University. She also has a professional designation degree in visual communications from the Fashion Institute of Design and Merchandising Los Angeles. This means other titles could certainly come after Princess. And the Crown Prince is certainly not left out. Prince Hussein has a degree from the Royal Military Academy Sandhurst in England, as well as a degree from Georgetown University, Washington, D.C. This is an impressive track record for the royal couple. No wonder they hit it off so well. Prince Hussein and Princess Rajwa are taking their time to enjoy this moment of joy in their lives. They both made several statements expressing their joy and excitement concerning being parents for the first time. Princess Rajwa told Hello Arabia in an exclusive interview, We are overjoyed to begin this new chapter in our lives. Our family is growing and we're excited to welcome our little one into the world. Crown Prince Hussein also shared with Al Arabia that he and his beautiful wife, Rajwa, were very excited about the new phase. The Crown Prince added, Everything will change with the kids for sure. I don't know what to expect, but thank God we're excited and the family is excited too. The King and Queen were not left out as they were also quick to show their support to the new parents. Prince Hussein's mom, Queen Rania, went on social media to express her happiness regarding the birth of Amman. She wrote on X, previously Twitter, Praise be to God for his greatest gifts. You have enlightened our lives with our precious granddaughter Aman. May God protect us from you. Congratulations to Hussein and Rajwa, and may God fill your lives with blessings and contentment. The queen later shared some official photos of her cradling the newborn baby alongside her husband, the king, and their children on Instagram. These pictures were found to be a little different from what we were used to from the royal births because the official pictures are usually just the new parents with their child, and not the extended family as in the case of the royal family of Jordan. Iman, you've already got a hold of my heart. Our family has never been happier, Queen Rania captioned the Instagram post. King Abdullah also released a statement of his own on what was previously Twitter. He wrote, Praise be to God who gave us our first granddaughter, Iman bint al Hussein. I congratulate Al Hussein and Rajwa Al Azizan on their newborn baby. We ask God to give her good growth and protect her for her parents. You enlightened our family, grandfather. This entire moment is just very heartwarming for the royal family of Jordan and the people of Jordan. The royal family has also faced sad moments as this happy news comes just months after Princess Rajwa tragically lost her father in February, which was just months after she got married into the royal family. Princess Rajwa's father, Halid bin Musaid bin Saif bin Abdulaziz al Saif, passed away at the age of 71. A whole lot is yet to be revealed about Princess Rajwa's pregnancy journey and birth, but we're keeping our fingers crossed for more details to come to light. But hey, that's all from us. Now it's your turn. What do you think about the Jordanian royal family's response to the news of Amman's birth? And what are your thoughts on the name of the child and the meaning behind it? Let us know what you think in the comments down below. We love reading your thoughts and remember to subscribe for the latest on the gossip and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!